guys, Auto Fanatic. This is the official release video of my 007 Gloss Enhancer. Super excited. We did a pre-sale uh, just off my Instagram post, and I, I love seeing the feedback. I love when you guys share the, uh, the photos with me off Instagram. And uh, the first 500 orders, all of that's getting donated to charity. I'll shoot a video on that separately uh, in the coming weeks. But just wanted to show you guys, this is what you're going to get. You're going to get the professional grade sprayer. You're not going to get the cheap sprayer that every big company gives you when you buy a 16 ounce or a 32 ounce bottle. Uh, these things are terrible. They're cheap. You know, you increase your profits by using cheap stuff like this. But you know what? I don't really care because I'm doing this uh, to give you guys a superior product that's affordable and it's going to do its job. So this particular bottle, $17.95, we also offer it as a refill for a few dollars less if you already have this, uh, the sprayer or you place an initial order you want to do a repeat order. So we're going to do flat rate shipping on a lot of this stuff. Up to five bottles could go in one box for one flat rate. Uh, the feedback has been through the roof. People have used every other product on the market. Uh, I'm not going to mention names right now, but products that have costed up to $60 to $75 a bottle and 007 blows them away. No streaks, no haze, no high and low spots, no cure time. You don't need 15 towels to, uh, to use it. It works on matte, satin, vinyl wraps, ceramic coated cars, works incredible. So you guys with ceramic coated cars, you know the issues you have with upkeep and maintenance, uh, especially with a lot of hazing and a lot of marring and a, and a lot of film that you're gonna get with a lot of these products on the market. I'm not gonna market this as a nano ceramic technology or an SI whatever. Uh, that's all marketing BS. Uh, you guys have no idea what some of this stuff is behind the scenes, but it's just all marketing and the stuff just doesn't work and they're charging you more money for it. I feel that this is a superior product. It does the job of 10 different products, works on every solid surface material. And uh, I'll show you in the video here, a lot of YouTubers are gonna be uh, doing videos on this stuff. Stay tuned, the word is spreading like crazy. This stuff has been shipped all over the world. We're ramping up production now to, uh, to crank out a pretty big run. The website store is finally open. Go to autofanatic.com. The link will be posted in the description of this video. Please place your order, enjoy the video, and uh, thanks for the support. All right, guys, now we're at the drying phase of the wash. We're gonna take the 007 gloss enhancer, and this stuff is incredible. When the car is wet, like you see here, we're just gonna mist the crap out of the hood, and you guys are gonna get the professional trigger sprayers, not the cheap crap that everybody else gives you, because I actually care about the performance of the stuff that I'm putting out. And then you take, like I like the PFMs, and then you simply just drag it across, like that, and you're done. And you can probably see the re reflectivity in the camera and the gloss that this product leave, leaves behind. Now to show you another test, while we got the car hood dry, we're gonna leave the camera there and we're gonna show you how the water just flies right off the surface. That is identical to the hydrophobic and sheeting properties of a ceramic coating, and I'm giving it to you in a spray bottle that you could do right after you wash. See it again. This car stays outside. It's not garage. It hasn't been wa waxed in nine months. Look at the way that water just flies right off the car. Okay, guys? So that's just a quick demo of the Autofanatic 007 Gloss Enhancer. This stuff kicks ass. This is not some generic detail spray. It has more solids in it than it does water. And you guys can see it right here on a white car as a drying aid and the hydrophobic properties and the water sheeting abilities that most ceramic coatings give, you could get it on your car conventionally. Sure. I'm going to show you guys how I apply it when the car is dry and then we're going to split the other side of the hood up, we're going to hose it down and then we're also going to do a demo on the windshield. I want to show you guys how this stuff works on glass because this polymer that's in this and like I said, I demanded more solids in the product than water. It bonds to the surface and it actually bonds to the painted surface as well. So you're going to see the hydrophobic properties of this. It gives the car the feel of Colonite 915 and that was my target. Can we do that type of a result? Make it easy to use. There's no cure time. You don't have to come back hours later. You don't need to use 15 microfiber towels. This is a one shot deal. When your car is uh, doing your final rinse, mist the entire car down. You could do it in direct sunlight, dry it up, and it's done. When the car is dry, you could go over it in one shot as well, 
use a clean microfiber towel and it's going to have the same effect. I personally like to do it when the car is wet. It just makes, makes it a little bit easier. Uh, and I just think the results are absolutely outstanding. So, and you're just going to miss, you know, miss the panel well. Now we're going to be using the Griot's Garage original PFM drying towel. It's actually still damp. And all we're going to do is lay it on the surface, go back and forth, and that's it. And we're done. There's no streaks. There's no hazing. Uh, you don't have to sit there trying to buff it all out like on a lot of products that have a wax-based system, like a lot of Carnuba-based products that they try to you know, make a sprayable uh, Carnuba. Those tend to be really, really hard to apply. I wanted this to be super easy. The finish feels incredible. I'm going to show you right now. I have a pitcher of water, and I'm going to show you how the water just flies right off the car. Okay. You guys know, you follow what's going on with ceramic coatings. They do those tests all the time. This car does not have a ceramic coating, never had. I do call a 9915. The last time I put a coat of wax in this car, was I believe March or April. Ever since I started testing the 007 Gloss Enhancer, it has extended the life of the coating. I wash my car four to five times a week, much more than a lot of you guys out there. And regardless of which soaps you're using, all of the snow foams have a sodium hydroxide element to it. Sodium hydroxide is a stripping agent. It usually strips waxes and strips sealants, and a lot of soaps do that. But with the 007, this stuff doesn't wash off. And that's what's great about it. I've noticed um, the same longevity and the same feel, wash after wash after wash. So it's just super, super incredible. But you guys could see the water didn't really beat off. The water just flew off. And if we take the blow dryer, boom, the, the water's right off the hood of the car. I'm going to mist up the, uh, the other side of the car. I'm going to show you what it wet, and I'm going to show you uh, the same result. So I'm just going to give it a quick mist. Nothing crazy. And while the paintwork is wet, and you could see already, how as soon as I hit the panel that was wet, how the water is starting to fly off the paintwork. You can see it all through here. You see all those streaks? That just shows that the polymer used in my product is doing its job, and that's what we want. And we're going to do the same process. We're going to just take the PFM and just lightly drag it across the surface, like I show you, and it's done. There's no streaks. There's no cure time. You don't have to come back and rub it. And that's that. So okay, guys. You see it right there. This is reacting just like a ceramic coating would do on your car, except it's not going to cost you thousands of dollars and crazy application methods. I mean, look at this. So not only is this going to make your drying process easier, it's going to keep dust off your car, it's going to keep any airborne particles from settling and sticking to your car. You're not going to have to clay the car anymore, for the most part, if you upkeep your car regularly. It's going to make the water fly off your windows when it rains. It's going to make your maintenance washes go 50% quicker, I will guarantee it. You guys see it right there. A quick demo on the front windshield of my GT350, and we're just going to give it a good mist on both sides and when I spray it on glass I usually will wait about a minute or so before I pull it off just because I, I really want it to bond to the surface and I want it to do its most effective job but like I said when the car is doing your final rinse just hit the whole car and you're still gonna get the same protection uh, that I'm showing you guys in this demo so you can see it already as it starts to run that's as it's starting to kick so let's just go over it pull the wiper out of the way and that's it perfectly streak free glass is a real bitch when it comes to uh, any kind of spray sealants and uh, detail sprays so I'm gonna grab the, the garden hose I'm gonna saturate the window and I want you guys to see what's gonna happen as the water just flies right off So you guys can see it there in action, how each bead of water is just 
with gravity, it's just coming right off the, off the glass. It's a total piece of cake. It's going to make your glass clearer. It's going to make your wipers work better. Believe it or not, a lot of guys, when you have the squeaking uh, on the windshield wipers, it's usually because there's a film and a lot of stuff that's stuck to the window and you got to clay it and go through all of that process. But you guys can see it. I mean, it's crystal clear. Super easy to use. And uh, this stuff is so, so outstanding. I'm so excited for this product. I cannot wait to get this in your hands till you start using it and you start hitting me up telling me how incredible it is and how you've never seen anything like it before as far as the ease of use and the level of protection and water shedding capabilities. You guys could see the reflections and the gloss in the paint after drying the car with the Autofanatic 007 Gloss Enhancer. I didn't do a crazy scrub job on the wheels on purpose because I want to show you another demo on quick wheel detailing with the 007 because spray pattern of the hose otherwise you're gonna have to like lay down on the ground so you're pretty much gonna be aiming down and straight ahead but now what about all the dirt that's gonna be trapped on the inside of the spokes elsewhere and that's usually where uh, during your drying phase you would use a product and go over and touch up the wheels and with the 007 not only are you touching up the wheels to get all the excess debris that you missed in the rinse down off but you're actually adding a layer of protection that's going to make the brake dust repel and not adhere to the face of the rim. And especially on you guys that have gloss black, matte black wheels, this is super important, especially on the barrels and on the face. And uh, I'm going to show you how quick it is uh, to get that done. We're going to just give this a little bit of a mist. And we're going to hit just like that. And the synthetic polymer in this formula, it lifts the dirt off the wheels instantly. There's like no effort. You're not going to run into those issues like if you were to use like a cleaner or a degreaser where you're going to get spots that are just going to be missed. And I could feel it already. And I'm going to show you guys a quick test just by throwing this on there and getting all the little brake dust off because I didn't towel dry this on purpose. I wanted to show you guys and when you guys use this, you're going to notice it immediately, the slickness between your towel and the surface. And it's just, it's out of control, it really is. And get in there, you know, for the barrel or any other spots that you missed. And that's it. The rim is perfectly detailed, 100%. And this is a gloss black wheel, so it doesn't hide anything. So I got a sprayer filled with water. And I'm going to zoom in. You guys can see it there. How the water just completely sheets right off the surface. And that's what's really cool about this product, guys. Is that you're getting that layer of protection. And you're getting the ease of use. You're not going crazy with a Carnuba spray-based product. You don't have to wait for it to cure. You don't need any kind of fancy application methods. You just hit it, wipe it down, and it bonds to the surface instantly. Uh, no BS. You guys see it in the demos uh, on this video. So I hope you guys got a couple of tips um, that placed your orders on how to use this product. You could use it dry. You could use it wet. Uh, like I said, right now the wheel is wet. Hit it again, and we'll just go in there. And we'll dry it off. So th this is what you would probably do during your wash process is as you do your final rinse down, like I told you guys, just spray the entire car, you know, dry off your paint and then come down here and do your wheels and, uh, you know, leave your wheels wet. It'll just make it a little bit easier. The product will just extend itself a little bit more. You'll get a little bit more yield. And uh, that's it, guys. So there you go. Can't get simpler than that. And if you guys, you guys got to feel the surface. I mean, it, it's just unbelievable. You would think that I just threw a coat of wax on these wheels, and these wheels get hit with wheel cleaner four to five times a week. Okay? Four to five times a week, sometimes even more, because I'm still doing testing on the final version of the Auto Fanatic wheel cleaner. So, see you guys soon. Stay tuned to the rest of the video. So, we're going to show you a, a demo here on a matte black wheel on the Challenger TA. 
And like I say, you're going to miss spots when you wash your rims. That's just uh, the nature of it. On a black wheel, it's not very forgiving. Are we using the, uh, yeah, these are like the Chemical Guys standard uh, yeah. dual weave microfibers. Nothing crazy. And like I said, for rims, they work well. Yeah. They you do know, you don't feel bad throwing them out. <laughs> the PFM towels and some of the Gion stuff, it's a little expensive. You kind of like want to hold on to that. I actually enjoy doing this part of the clean deal. Yeah, it's I don't know why. Satisfying. I, just, I like yeah. doing the like the fine details yeah. and just going over stuff. Going that rim is flawless. It's got the protection. It's got the shine. And any little bit of brake dust you get, the 007 gloss enhancer just knocks it right off. No streaks, no smudges, no residue. You can just see the way the water just flies right off. hose while it's pouring just to capture this on video for you guys and look at the windshield look at the way that water just flies right off side glass same deal guys